All right, welcome, welcome everybody. So today we're gonna go over something exciting that Revel Point has released. We have the new Metro X scanner, but as you probably know already, you can buy different packages. You have the standard one and you have the advanced. And something nice about the advanced package is it comes with the marker kit. So that's what I wanna focus on in this video. Let's go over what's in this marker kit. So this is the box. Let me open it up. As you can see, it's a nice protective foam good quality that's going to keep your markers all organized and protected well. And what we have going on is we got these bars. We got the four marker bars. And this one, it's going to, they're going to come like this. This has no marker dots on it. I've already added to some of them. So that's how all these are going to work. The bars come with no marker dots, but then you have half domes and you have balls and you have pyramids, those will come with some marker dots already stuck on them, but you can add some if you'd like, or take them off, it's, that's your personal preference. Only that's, the only thing that's coming with, from the start, no marker dots, is the bars. So, four bars, and then we're gonna have 10 half domes that's included in the kit. And these are all magnetic, as you can see, the balls are just like stuck to the half domes. And we're gonna have 10 balls. And I definitely, through this video, I wanna show you some comparisons of other um, kits out there. Not necessarily kits, but other markers that you can find. And just the quality difference. So we'll get the 10 balls out. Half, ten half domes, and then we got four pyramids that it comes with. Right here. So again, that is, oh, I missed one of the balls, there we go. Then you got that, the empty box. So again, organize nicely. That's a benefit, a benefit in itself. When you're done using it, you can put it back in here and keep them organized, and you won't be losing them that way. So let's do some comparisons. This is what you get with the package, with the kit. But this is some of the other ones that you could maybe find or make on your own. So we got a pyramid, this random shape, and a half dome. Just looking at the difference in the quality, you can in, in, most likely can see from there that they're different. But let's, let's do the classic test of hitting them. All right, so pretty solid. You hear that? And then when you hit something like this one, Cheap plasticky sound. So right off the bat, you know that the quality is good. It, they're very solid, they're durable. These are not magnetic. And what's coming in the kit is all magnetic, except for the bars. But what's cool about the bars is they come equipped with M6, six millimeter screw, which is standard, or a quarter inch. Pretty much a lot of things, if you're gonna need to screw something into it, will be M6 or quarter inch. For example, our dual axis turntable. So this comes with four screw holes, and that's perfect for the bars. So an example in a situation where you're gonna wanna scan something that's a little more narrow and tall, put these in there. You can even screw them into one another, and I'll show you a, a good example of something you need these bars on top of each other for. Something like this gear. Super long, narrow, put that in the middle of the turntable. And as long as you put more marker dots on this, you really should be able to capture this quite well without actually having to put any marker dots on the gear itself. So this is a good example for something that I would use these bars for. Also, something that's pretty slick, and I mentioned this earlier, slide this over. Some items that you're scanning might even have you know the standard screw hole so this is some part of an engine you see different areas that when it's mounting actually to the vehicle you're going to need to screw it well you can actually use the bars there in themselves so that's cool not all of them like this is definitely bigger than a quarter inch or m6 but a few of them are perfect like here so it saves you time again you don't have to take all the marker dots and individually you definitely want to add some to this piece, but if you already have some already stuck to the bars, just stick these bars in the existing screw holes, 
and it's going to allow you to scan this relatively smooth and fast and get a nice result. And again, because they're magnetic, just stick them to it as long as this piece is magnetic, which this is not. I'll show you another example. But you can always rest them on there, you know, as long as you're not going to be, if you're just going to be trying to get the upper portion of this, you could just rest them on there as well, even if they're not magnetic. So that is one of the applications. Let's take this off, and I'll show you another one, something that you could maybe use the pyramids for that would be helpful. Some objects, as you're scanning them, you want to elevate them a little bit. So when you're actually running them through the software and editing it, it makes it easier to cut the bottom. So the pyramids in themselves, because they are durable and can actually handle some things that are heavier, so this one you might not want to put too many heavy things on because it is just this cheap plastic. But with what Revel Point's given you here, you could put a relatively heavier piece on these pyramids, balance it nicely, something like that. It would be better for me to do it on this side. Because when editing, then you'll be able to cut it off much nicer. Something like that. And it also be gathering the markers from the pyramids themselves. So not only is it supporting the object, you're going to make it easier to edit it, is it also is collecting these markers that's on the pyramid itself. So that's an option with the pyramids. This too, I was using this wrench earlier to demonstrate the quality. Magnetic, you could stick these right to it which is handy instead of having to load it up with the actual sticky marker dots. Just clink them right to there and that saves time with that so that is really nice. And I'm sure you remember back in the day our scanners came with the magic mat which was a great tool, helpful, but now these can kind of replace the magic mat and actually even help you get better results because you can randomly place these around whatever item you're scanning. You know, it can be the domes, the pyramids, or the balls. And it's going to help you pick up whatever item you're scanning better. And especially if you have an item like this that has a hole. Typically, if you're scanning something like this, it might just fill that in with point clouds and make that one solid surface. So the half domes would come in handy here. Put it in the center, and then it makes it really easy to cut that out in editing after you're done when you're doing that whole process. Also another example, I just want to show you this, I have this muffler here. Another cool thing, when normally you would spend 20 minutes putting all the marker dots all over this, you already have your pyramids, your balls, your half domes with the marker dots on them, and this is magnetic, so just stick it to the object, and it's easy to cut them off as well because of the shape, especially the balls here. I think this is a really great application for using the balls, maybe not as much the pyramids, because it makes it easy when editing to slice them off. So just going over that, good quality, very versatile, the fact that it comes with four different marker options, the ball, the pyramid, the half dome, and the bars. It's cool that the bars have the M6 quarter inch standard screw fit, so that fits into a lot of things besides our turntable, it should fit into some other things as well that you're scanning. You're going to be happy with this. The quality is good and it comes with a nice organizing box for you to not lose your pieces. So I hope that was helpful. Let me know what you think. I look forward to hearing about the results you get. But all in all, the Metra X marker kit is a great piece.